this house retains much of its original charm, with its box bay window, stuccoed porch with wide supports, and the use of wood shingle on the upper story. Although, if you look at historic pictures, you'll notice that the wide eaves have been trimmed, resulting in the loss of decorative woodwork in the front gable end. Pantown was more than just a collection of homes. Pandolfo hoped that it would be a community, saying Pantown was a city unto a city, making workers and their families happy. Some of that happiness came from the physical amenities, the attractive housing, a safe neighborhood, and recreational facilities. Pantown invested in street lights and curbed roads that controlled water runoff. It had its own well for water. There was a volunteer fire department. The company also pressed the St. Cloud Street Railway Company to extend its tracks out along 8th Street North, but the effort was unsuccessful. An expert was hired to look after the buildings, lawns, and grounds of Pantown, and the houses were laid out so that there was sufficient space for kitchen gardens next to each home. Pantown even had a welfare department, managed by F. A. Gustafson. For single men, Pandolfo built a hotel near the plant, complete with a large dining room and a lunch counter, open almost 24 hours. But Pandolfo went a step further, as his promotional book, Pictorial Proof of Progress, states, An organization in which every resident of the community is a member meets at regular intervals to discuss and take action on matters that affect the welfare of the community. A Sunday school has been provided and a school site has been secured nearby. Social events of various nature provide a fund of wholesome entertainment. In his vision, he saw a hospital to care for the sick, a community house for the entertainment and club life of hundreds of employees, and an athletic field for the indulgence of manly sports. But even as employees moved into their new homes, trouble was brewing for Sam Pandolfo, and soon the community would be left on its own. 